Hey, what's up, Wild Wormhole? I am here, I am D-House here with the Wild Wormhole to talk about combos that new players and returning players should know about so that when you sit down to play a game of Keyforge, you can look at your opponent's deck list, which is one of the great things about Keyforge. You get to look at your opponent's deck list unless it's sealed and look at potential combos that you can play into. And so um, I'm taking cards from one of my favorite Dark Tidings decks to illustrate an important combo that, that uh, combines Diplomat Egung and Grand Alliance Council, also known as GAC. Yeah, uh, GAC. Um, to help you understand how powerful this combo is, I've laid out some cards from the deck just to help you see what's going on. Um, so Diplomat Egung is a very powerful creature, has two powers, says play, fight, reap. For the remainder of the turn, a friendly creature belongs to the house of your choice in addition to its other houses. Now, you could play this out and just use another creature, you know, that you've played to become a Star Alliance creature, and then you just use it to reap. Great. That's good value, but if you can combine Diplomat Aegon with Grand Alliance Council, you may be able to do crazy things to destroy your opponent's board. Grand Alliance Council says play, choose a creature of each house, destroy each creature not chosen. So you play out Diplomat Aegon. It's obviously Star Alliance. Um, it says a friendly creature belongs to the house of your choice, so you can choose Aegon. Let's say I had no. Let's say I had no creatures out and they had this big old board over here. I can play Aegung out here. And I'm going to say, you know what? Um, Aegung also belongs to, looking at the board, I don't like this stuff over here, also belongs to Shadows. So when I play Grand Alliance Council, I choose a creature of each house. So first I choose Star Alliance. Aegung is the uh, creature that's going to survive. So Aegung's going to die. Um, and Aegung is also Shadows. So, because he's also Shadows, Shoulder is going to die, Whisper's going to die, and uh, we'll leave the Muckling out because we could probably take care of him and let the Deep Water Druid die. So, what started as a 0 versus 5 turned into a 1v1 scenario by understanding the combo potential of Diplomat, A Gun, and Grand Alliance Council. These are both commons in the Star Alliance Suite in Dark Tidings. So, it is very likely if you're playing a Dark Tidings event that you might see this in a Star Alliance um, matchup. So be aware that this is something that could come. If you see Diplomat Aegon on the board, you probably want to kill it. Because if you don't, it could penalize you very deeply. Um, hope you guys enjoy these combo videos. If it's helpful, please send to a friend who's jumping back into Keyforge or jumping in for the first time. And... Uh, that's it. Hope you're all all of your wild wormholes are absolutely chaotic. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Thanks for tuning in.